We have listed very important news that happened today in the Ukraine-Russia war. Russian Security Council Deputy Secretary Dmitry Medvedev said that nuclear weapons are a foundation for Russia. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres told a UN Security Council meeting chaired by Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov that Russia's invasion of Ukraine has caused great suffering and destruction. On a trip to Ukraine, Estonian Prime Minister Kaya Kalas said he supported Kiev's calls for EU membership as well as joining NATO as soon as circumstances allow. Russia has begun using new T-14 Armata battle tanks to fire on Ukrainian positions, Russia's state news agency reported. According to UK intelligence, the number of daily casualties in Russia has decreased by roughly 30% in April. According to Ukrainian intelligence chief Kirillo Budano, Russia has taken defensive positions in all areas of action except Bakhmut. Russia's foreign minister has announced the expulsion of a Moldovan diplomat in retaliation for the expulsion of a Russian ambassador in Moldova last week. Ukraine has rescued 138 individuals besieged by combat in Sudan, including its own residents and citizens of Georgia and Peru, according to Ukraine's military intelligence. To reach all actual news, fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.